Assalamu alaikum friends, hope you are alright. Today we are going to look at how to install Python. So without wasting any time, let's get started. First of all, you need to put the link in Google, which I have provided in the description below. A window such as the one you can see here will be opened. You can see the download button here. Click on it. Here you can see two download options. One is for the professional PyCharm while the other is community. There is a minor difference between these two and the difference lies in the number of functions available. But still for the learning process community PyCharm will be good enough. So now we will click on this download option. So you can see the download has just begun. It will take some time and as the download process is completed, we will move on to the installation process. Now as I already mentioned that for learning we can use community PyCharm. But still if you want to download the professional one, you can do so. But you have to pay for its installation. So friends, the download process has just completed. Now we will open this file for the installation purpose. So now a dialog box will appear which will ask you whether you want to allow this app to make changes to your device or not. So click on yes then click next again and again till the installation process initiates. So now you can see that the installation process has completed. Now check the box here and then click finish. So after some processing, now again a dialog box will appear of terms and conditions. You can read them all and then check the box right here. So friends, after reading all these terms and conditions, click on continue. Here again, you can see a dialog box asking you whether they should share data with you or not. You can choose one of these options. It's totally up to you guys. You can choose either one of them. So now you can see that the PyCharm app is going to be opened. Here you can see the window which is looking something like this. You can click here on the new project. So friends, uh, we have successfully installed the PyCharm app. If you find this video interesting, then you should please subscribe to this channel and I will see you in the next video. Take care.